My metric number is 188794. Hi, my name is Nurun Binti Mahmud. My metric number is 190638. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to the viewers and our lecturer, Dr. Amallah. Okay. Uh, in, in our project, we choose traffic light. So what is traffic light? Traffic light is a traffic signal, traffic lamps, signal lights, stop lights or traffic control signals. Traffic lights usually position at a road in intersections or pedestrian crossing and also uh, other locations to control the traffic. So uh, there are three main light in traffic lights which is uh, red, yellow and green. Uh, the red one is the, up, the upper one uh, is to uh, give instru uh, instructions to the uh, drivers to stop the car and then uh, the yellow color is to warn that the signal is about to change to red. So lastly the uh, green color is uh, to allow traffic to proceed to their destinations. Okay, and lastly, the traffic lights has proved to be an amazing way to stop the collisions from happening and to smoothing the traffic. Okay, uh, I will uh, briefing about our uh, software that we use in this project. In our project, we use Proteus Design Suite which is an electronic design automat automatization EDA. The function of Proteus are to drawing schematic diagram of our project. And then we use micro C for PIC, which is a full future ANSI C compiler for PIC device 
and we also write our project using micro C software. And then uh, micro C also features powerful compiler with advanced SSA optimizations and have a lots of hardware and software libraries. And lastly, it also has ad additional tools to make our project easier. Okay, thank you. As we know that, uh, our group uh, choose traffic light as our mini project. So, there are three objectives in this mini project. First, uh, to learn how to use Proteus and Micro C. We use Proteus uh, to draw the schematic diagram of the traffic light and Micro C to run the code for the traffic light. Okay. Second is to learn how to draw a schematic diagram of traffic light. Uh, at first, it is so complicated, but we manage uh, to draw the schematic diagram of traffic light. Uh, we use uh, many reference uh, such as uh, internet uh, to get the correct schematic diagram of uh, our traffic light and then uh, uh, to learn how to program a three junction traffic light uh, we use micro c to compile and run the program uh, we search the coding from the internet as our reference and we try to make it uh, different from the internet okay that's all thank you Okay, so next I am going to explain about the schematic diagram of this traffic light uh, program. Uh, before that, um, as mentioned earlier, Pro Proteus actually means processor for text easy to use. Basically, be before you do a uh, 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 some program, you need to do the simulation first using Proteus. From here, we have the PIC16F877A and PIC stands for Peripheral Interface Controller which uh, before that we use micro C to compile the code and then we will put it into the PIC. Um, from here, oh, uh, the function of PIC is to get program code into the target PIC which is mentioned earlier. Okay, so next, um, we choose PIC16F877A because it has the targeted pins that will be connected to three traffic lights. Um, and as you can see up there, the, the 33 pin connected to the red light of the first traffic light and it continues and going down um, and we also use resistor for each line to uh, limit the current okay when you see the traffic lights uh, simulation you can see that the first uh, traffic light comes green while the other two stays red and then when uh, it, the, the traffic light it turns yellow and to warn uh, the drivers to stop at the junction and finally uh, wait green, yellow and finally the tree will turn red for a few seconds this is to avoid um, any accidents or such thing uh, and then the next traffic light will turn uh, will continue to turn uh, green, yellow and red and then the third one will continue like before. So that's all. Thank you.
Okay, so this is the coding um, for our mini project, which is for traffic light. We use Micro C as a compiler. It is the best solution for developing the, uh, for developing code. Okay, void delay. Void delay is the functions. Delay functions is used to suspend execution, uh, uh, suspend to suspend execution for particular times. It requires unsigned integer. Uh, so can you see this? Uh, there is only the positive integer. We cannot uh, we cannot put the negative integer because time uh, we don't have a negative. So next is this uh, trees B. Trees is ten for uh, trees ten, uh, which is a uh, yeah, the port that waiting for input rather than output, a low or high. Um, it is because a port can have three states. First, output high. Second, output low. And the last one is input high impedance. Next, uh, we use while statement for our iteration statement. While has two types. First, um, we use while that can repeat for a certain time and the second one is um, we use file uh, we use while that can uh, for uh, uh, infinite loops. Um, so in our program, we use a uh, while uh, the bracket one. Uh, it means for uh, infinite loops. And then uh, this uh, the last one is port. Port is used to write or read the port value. Okay, so that's all. Okay, uh, now we will proceed to the last one Which is conclusion Okay, for this project We have designed a traffic light controller Using Proteus and Micro C software So, the actually it was really an exciting project Because Exciting project because it introduced us with the software that we not used to, and uh, because uh, before this we uh, only used Dev. So um, and we uh, and you can see that it was really amazing to see that on how traffic light controller work was. Okay. Um, Okay, actually this programming project uh, includes a uh, groups, so it's, it's also help us to do this not only taught us how to do programming but also help us to understand this and uh, real value if learning in learning C programming. Okay, at the end of the project um, at the end of the project, it gives it gives us well understanding uh, about programming, coding, and running the program successful. Um, although the although we face uh, really many challenges and difficulties during do this project, but finally our project turned very turn out well and we will try but we will still try to improve our knowledge in the future but the most important is we successful to achieve our three objectives okay. so uh, after after watch this show you know what is traffic light right so uh, you can try this at home just copy uh, the coding and uh, how to draw the schematic diagram uh, and uh, one more thing uh, do like and follow uh, do like and comment uh, our video we will reply it as soon as possible uh, thank you arigato gozaimasu <laughs> sayonara, sayonara.